All right, welcome, welcome, everybody. My name is Ebang, and today we're gonna go ahead and play another episode of Let's Try Down. Today we are trying out Kinseed, which is basically a sandbox RPG adventure life sim where we pretty much can run around and make a life, and we get to build up our character, our hero here, and we'll go into some battles. That just uh, it was a turn-based battle system, and we get to open up our own shops, run our own towns, I think we even create our own farms, and eventually, maybe even make uh, our own family tree. But this game has been in develop for some quite some time now, I think over like two years, so I just now happened to kind of come across of it, look more into it. And, you know, it did really pique my interest in what it is and what it has to offer. And with it being a sandbox and an RPG, it's kind of right up my alley. So I'm really eager to get into it. So we'll go ahead and hop in here and give it a go. All right, here we are. Welcome back. Let's do it. Let's get into this. Pot. That's his name. Hello there, Dreaming One. Name is Pot. Let's have some fun. I was given a special task. Some intriguing questions must be asked. Step through the door with a brave face. Enter the very special place. I will meet you. Meet you. Give you some choices. So listen to your inner voices. Go now, child. Don't be glum. Visit the woods of what's to come. Then when you, you when you wake, you must part the truth. Be known inside your great your heart. W A S D or left click to move. Shift left shift or R B to run. You can always run in the option screen. Escape key or start button so we have the ability to play with the controller as well which is nice um you can also play with the um mouse and keyboard um either way we're gonna go ahead and pop into the controller and just take over with that so it just seems to be a little bit more easier to move so now we're gonna go ahead what is this a sign we got a sign here and we're gonna go into the door and see what it has to offer <laughs> And we're going to be posed with some questions. Now let us start this audition. Tell me, child, your life's ambition. Run a business, raise a family, adventure, follow faith. Ah. Oh, so these are the doors we get to walk into. So if we go this way, we'll mainly go down the path of running a business. Here we can do raise a family, which I'm gonna kind of go ahead and pass on that because, um, in the start screen they basically said the updates to come, which the family portion and the kids portion has yet to come yet. So uh, I'm pretty sure there's some things there we can check out and play along, and it's probably not all complete. But we'll go ahead and skip that and wait for this down the line so it does come out. Maybe we'll revisit it at that time. And then we have the adventure and follow fate. I'm going to go down the adventure path. We're going to become a nice adventure, mercenary, a warrior, fighter. Get the monies and the ladies. Let's do this. Excitement tickles your fancy, I see. Now, what kind of adventure will ye be? Adventurer, I will be. What? A skilled ranger, a seeker of knowledge, nature lover, and treasure hunter. Ooh, excitement tickles your fancy, I see. All right. Hmm. It would be cool if you could kind of like go in. Oop, don't want to go too close. So we could be a ranger. Um, could be nice if it actually kind of broke down what was what here. But we got the seek of knowledge. So I'm going to go ahead and guess here. So this is obviously a ranger, right? Bows. Seeker of knowledge is probably some form of mage, you know, magic. Uh, nature lover is probably some form of like cleric, druid, healers, you know, things like that. Treasure hunter is more probably the warrior side of things. You know, going on expeditions, adventures, and collecting the loot. I'm kind of got to go that route because, you know, I like that whole treasure hunter pirate vibe. Let's do it. I like this. I like how you're kind of building out your character through the paths that we are walking down. 
Um, a legacy ye hope to grow, but remembered for, I must know. This is kind of cool. This is interesting. You're kind of building your backstory. So if it's like, you know, a lot of RPGs where you kind of go through and select certain pre-designated, like, stories, or if you even go uh, way back to, like, you playing D&D, you do create your backstories um, on your own character sheets and stuff like that. So this is what you kind of do. So now we're going to go ahead and name what we're remembered for. So I'm pretty sure these choices we make will define some other NPCs on how they uh, react towards us and kind of if they know us, I'm assuming. Uh, my generosity, my skills, things I created, deeds I did. Hmm. So we can go in where people remember us due to our awesomeness. Or we can go over here and pick this side for people to remember us of how nice and cool we are. Or we can come over here and people can really appreciate the things we made and build and created with our bare hands. Or the task that we did to help people. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, deeds I did or my skills. I kind of want to go through those two. So in my skills, people want me and are remembering me for my awesomeness. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. Let's see here. Questions done now. Very good. I can see why Fairweather likes your blood. He gives this gift, so hold it tight and wait for his call one mighty night. Or one misty night. Oops. Cool. All right. Let's see what this is all about. We picked some choices. We have kind of created our character here. Is that a little box of goodies? Yep. A gift. There you are. Come on over here. No. I don't want to go anywhere. Nice. So here we are in the world of Kinsey. Oh, there we go. So how do we run again? We run right here. Come talk to me. Hold A and choose the chat option. Ah, okay, so we can close out and we'll talk. Sibling. Oh, it's our sister. Well, that's one way to get out of doing any work. Why didn't I think of them? Weird dreams, huh? You should hear about the one I had last night. But now we're supposed to be doing our chores, remember? Don't pretend you lost your journal, Lazy Bones, because I have it right here. Open the journal with C down on the D-pad or clicking the flashing icon in the bottom left. Beat the pig daily. Or okay, love nothing better than food. Okay, so yeah, we gotta feed the pig. Let's pin that. That's our quest for the day. Task, date, tips. When you have someone or something selected, hold interact with A for living things you'll and get a choice of options aside from all to all to all tools blah 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 all tools use the right trigger for control you can adjust the power of an action before release if you don't want to use full power open the journal with C down on the d-pad or clicking the flashing icon in the bottom ah, yep, yep. So you noticed the job I added, huh? Well, it is your turn. It's right here on the calendar. I check mine every day to make sure I don't forget things. And maybe when you have time, you can work on that map you're always going on about. Thought you might take it with you. Open the map with M. Back button on the controller, clicking the flashing. Aha! Doesn't look like you've got far mapping the local area better find some map stones around the farm so you can work out where things are oh and you've got a world map on the other side nice world map active task oh 
the, the world map is what? These little... Oh, I see right here. These little circles. There's the paths. Okay. Pretty good size map. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Looking good. All right. Close. I almost forgot. Uncle Bill got us a satchel each so we can carry anything we need. They're a bit old and musty, but there are ours. We never had anything like this back at the shoe. Open the inventory with I up on the D-pad. Okay. Got an inventory now. Cool. Fruit and veg, fish, herbs, cooked, other. Items, equipment, collect. Prefer books, okay. Anyway, I think that's it. Maybe once you finish your ch your chores, you can start exploring. Can't wait to have adventures myself. I mean, I mean, isn't this place amazing? I still can't believe we're here. I always daydream some relative would show up one day and take us away from the show from the shoe. But I never thought someone like Uncle Bill could really exist. Oh, that's right. He wanted to talk to you about something. Better pop up. Better pop over to the house. See what it is. Task added. Ta talk to your uncle. So what do you want now? You got a question mark, huh? Oh, interesting. So this is where we can do our relations. She likes candy hair. Apple pie and honey. Hates blueberry jam and blueberry and blueberry pie. She just hates blueberries. Okay. Traits, intelligence, tough, and brave. And her, lo her love meter towards me is about half. She's 12 years old. 14th summer. 14th summer. What else you got there for me? What's this? It was nice for Uncle Bill to leave a little signs around to help us. You should try reading them by interacting or using left trigger, left control. I know you can read. I can barely read. Get in there. And what's with the, um... I want to hear about the dream I had. Want to hear about the dream I had? a bit fuzzy now, but I, I was walking through the woods and this voice kept talking to me. I think it said I was going to live forever. Isn't that silly? Are you done now? Something you need? Okay, cool. No. Oh, picked up some so quite, quite expensive due inflation. Two star. Grassy... No gassy apple? So does that gassy apple? Then we got this pear, just the pear. Huh. Another apple here. We can get that. What's this? We got a little note. Some fear. Creatures go against the green of secrecy and sometimes show themselves in times of need. The brownie has been known to sometimes make itself known as the gilly willow, the toddy way, and the you know what the fuck the ba. However, the most common of these little creatures is the a person is new to the air, then they may see these sparkling little entities fluttering around points of interest. Points of interest, okay. If something is is of use, then the what zit will draw attention to it. The what zit. <laughs> well, however, not go away unless the object has been interacted with. It is as though the creature is insisting that it is your full attention. When satisfied, the what? The waddy, the waddy's it. We'll fly away. Happy. Well, as happy as a floating, blinking, glowing, flappy eye can be. Okay. Just gonna pick some apples. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. Just throw them at him. Sure. That's pretty funny. Got some more pears. Yeah, we're harvesting now. Let's get these apples. Yeah, so this game's looking pretty good. It's actually, I guess, it's from the developers that worked on the original Fable. They kind of broke apart and made their own little studio, and this is the game they're making. So they're definitely going to probably have a lot of kind of inspiration from that, using the kind of things with the family building, quest building, you know, and questing. And then, is this the... 
the thing, the onesie, the whatsie. No mail for me. Got a pig. That's Interact with the pig and choose the feed option top, then an item to feed it. Okay, so we definitely need to feed you. We can ride the pig? Cool. What's this? Let's give it some food. Let's give it an apple. Sweet. What does this do? Oh, we pet the pig. We can ride the pig. Wee! Giddy up, piggy, piggy. All right, I'm done with that. We dismount. And we can only pet it once. Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Stop it. Stop it. I want to pet you. Yay, pet you. Cool. So I guess the more I interact with the pig. What? How'd you get out? Get back in there. Stay. Oh, wait, did I set to follow? No, I did. Okay, that's the follow. Interesting, okay. And there's a bucket. Wooden bucket, never drink from this. Assigned to a slot. What's that? Oh. Strawberries. Got something over here. It says, dandelions are the common flower. It tells the time, but only only hour. Book. Clear as folk. It's a true, is it, it is a truth locally acknowledged that there is no place more peaceful, tranquil, and lush. Uh, yep, okay. I'm not going to go ahead and read all through that. Uh, push up and D-pad to access your inventory. There's something there too, so that must be the what's it. The what's it. Discovered map stones. Oh, so he's just gonna kind of fly everywhere. Interesting. So now we should have the map uncovered. Where is, these are my tasks. Meet Uncle Bill, unlock a map of Widden, Willow Dawn, Willow Down Farm. Kind of doing that, so we sh Oh, so we gotta go and collect everything. How the how are we supposed to get up there? Oh wait, it is up here. It's a little cliff. Boom, 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 boom. What is this? Look at the seeds of the dandelion flower. They point to the current hour. I don't know what that riddle is trying to tell me. Thank you ever so much for supporting this world with your own hard-earned brass. Here in the castle, we humbly appreciate this great sacrifice. What lies ahead in the immediate future on this still developing road? New combat system, more places to explore, having kids. Skills, perks, illness, arcane items. Yes, all that is coming over the protein months, as well as improvements to the realizing of features and controls. Do not worry, it is all in hand. Well, on a very long list, with the feedback from the kind spirits taking part in. Okay, cool. So this is kind of the message from the devs right here. I'll kind of show you what's still to come. So you can see more places to explore, a new combat system. They just released the revamp on the combat system, I think. Having kids is one thing, and then... The, and that's the thing. You can have kids in this. You can start a family. And, and as you pass away, like your character gets old. And as he gets old or even dies, you know, and then you would then pick up. From my understanding, you would pick up from where the kid, one of your kids, and then kind of cross over. So it has like this kind of like it Sims style of having kids where it, it will pull out attributes from each, you know, from the wife and the husband. And getting those skills to the pass down to the kid, and then you play as the kid. I guess I'm assuming. I don't know. It's all speculation at this point. It's kind of what I got. What it came across to me seems pretty interesting, though, none the least.
This game is definitely real chill and laid back, though. That's pretty nice. Um, so there's that. What's it? What do you got here? So here's our farm. We got a farm, so we can grow some things. Don't have any suitable seeds, so we got a farm. We just picked some cabbage. Okay, yeah. What's this? Watering can, basically a shower for plants. Ooh, got some carrots. I'm just going through and picking everything. I'm taking every little thing. What do you want? These apples. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I like to explore before I really do anything. There's something. You can collect honey if you have the right container. Uh huh. Outhouse. Oh, we just went to the bathroom. Cool. Nah. Nightberries only appear when nine dark bells ring so clear. Okay. Got some more riddles. Here's another map. Okay, we got it. We just did it, right? Oh, no. Nah. That's a pretty sweet map. So, that's me. So, we got some a question mark thing over there. Question mark thing. Question... Cool, so we probably can't really leave anywhere, so as we can see, yeah, it's gated, which is fine. We'll give us some time to kind of explore. Now we have a map. Uh, it kind of been really everywhere. I mean, the only thing I really have to do is talk to Uncle Bill, but, you know, Uncle Bill's busy milking a cow, so... Let's go do my thing. Um, uh, that's block. Can we fish? Cool. Uh huh. Discovered monument stone. Item permission granted. Twenty points of hit. He's already hurt. Uncle Bill, you're hurt. I like Uncle Bill, and I love my sibling. Okay. So I guess it kind of shows you the status of the town, the people in there. I guess if we go to other towns and stuff, we'll have a list of people who like you, love you, hate you. All that good stuff. All right. I guess we're kind of good here. Where's that? What's, what's it go? Or something. In the pounds of the bell, pound lurker flashes its floppy tail. Huh. What is that? What did I just pick up? It just gave me some thing at the top right there. Not sure what it was. Or what that is. Ew, the pig made a messy. Can you clean that up? Nope. <clears throat> oh, Bill's gone. See this. I picked this up and that gave me that. Collected an item, dandelion. Oh, so dandelion must be a special thing. Collected item. Dandelion. It's not really filling it up anymore. I collected three. I don't know if there's any more around here. So they do something. There's like a pair. Here's another one. So I'm just going to leave them for now. Wait, are they in my inventory? No. Oh, they, yeah, pick them up. Tell the time. Hmm. Feeling sleepy? I guess I'll pick them up.
Oh, wait. Tell the time. What does that even mean? Is that the time up there? Is that a clock? Over here running around at night. What's this? Need any existing container? Well, we do have a container. So that's how we can give gifts. What musical fruit do? So we can make, um, oh, strawberry jam. All right, we can make strawberry jam. Wanted to. Here's something. Lantern. All right. All right, um, doggone cat, nappy pig won't fly, sleep, acting wooly. Okay. Oh, dang, did I just pass out? What happened? I'm in the dream world. Well, this is interesting. I'm not really sure what's going on. I'm pretty sure I'm in a dream. Here's something. Oh, oh, whoa. Do you fear the shadows, my child? Or do you fear them calling? Or do you, or do you feel them calling you? You should hold them close and listen. The kinseed has chosen you for greatness. We'll speak again as summer tide fades and your closed eyes will be opened. Now wake up. Spirits come to me when I sleep. Auto save. Okay. Two brass waiting to collect and one new task added for the day. Our beds here are so much more comfy than your old ones, aren't they? I don't know. I fell asleep on the floor, so tell me all about it. As soon as I lie down, I can't keep my eyes open. Must be what Uncle Bill says. That the fae sprinkling sleeping, sleeping dust on children so we won't see them dancing in the moonlight. Cool. Task reward. Reward two brass for completing two tasks. Ah, that's how we get some money for the day. So the more tasks we do, the more money we get. Good morning. Sounded like you who had restless dreams. A good day's work is the best care for that. If you're going to be ready for summertime, we'll need the farm running at its best. So I need you to buy a new tin bucket in town. <laughs> I wonder what would happen if I actually did talk to him before I felt it passed out on the floor. I wonder what this conversation would have gone, or if I just missed this a, a conversation or something. He probably would have told me about going to sleep or something. Here, three brass should cover it. I've unlocked the west and south gates. Just watch out for old Herbert. If you go west, he's not a pretty sight. Oh. Oh, and you have a better, you have a letter waiting for the mailbox. In the mailbox, it's already more mail than I've gotten all year. Anytime you post, you have posts, you'll see the mailbox red rag. Fluttery. Status. Brad is stat browse status to see about yourself and villagers you encounter. Open your status info with L left on the D pad or clicking the flashing icon. Player. Robin. Not Robin. I didn't even get to click my name. So these are all NPCs. Oh my gosh. That's... Cool. We don't know his likes, hates, or traits, or anything. He's 55, though. That's... Off to the village, then. Be friendly to folk, and you are sure to go far. It might be worth buttering them up so they tell you things that may be useful. Knowledge is power, they say. May also say swallowing a frog cures some throats, so don't trust every 
expression. Maybe I should have picked a smaller frog. Anyway, good luck. On your way. My milk chun brings all the hobs to the yard. Wow. Feeding pigs and watering crops might not be the most exciting work in the world, but it's a good, honest living unless you're feeding a dishonest pig. <laughs> I suppose that's more of a gray area. I worked on this farm all my life, poured my life and soul into it. Can't tell you how good it feels to know it will stay in the family when you do inherit it. He likes me. Good morning. How are you? Anytime. Um, pop the better elderberries off bushes with the expert clean shot. Huh. <laughs> what is it like? What do you like? Do you like, uh, you like apples? Yeah, you do. Yeah, okay, the Danny line up on the right corner, that's the time. My name is Twig, and I'm inviting you for a visit. I got told you you would make a great friend i live in the nook north of your farm just across the river my hut is right at the top of the nook you can you cannot miss it to help me to help find me just follow that thought away you are bound to have one in your hair looking forward to see you soon so we can do some fishing your new pal twig Okay, with an after task set to the in the journal, press F1 or click on the left stick to get the directions on where to go. This will help guide you to the areas that objectives are in. You are in the, oh, okay, so in level, you are in the right level for this task. A blueberry. Blueberry. Let's see here. What we got over here? What is this? Oh, I didn't mean to write it. Get off. Oink. All right. So how do I? Is inventory again? So equipment. We got a watering can. A bucket. Wait, how do I set that? Equipped. Oh, okay. There we go. That's how we do it. We just hit the button we need. Okay. So now I got a bucket. Collect some water. Nothing to feel. You need an empty. Wait. I have a bucket. You need an empty and existing container to find one. I have one. Oh. The wooden bucket can't collect this. Oh, it tells me the bucket I need. We can make some food. What are my tasks today? Buy a tin bucket and be quick. Oh, that's what we're trying to do. Wait, so I got a wooden bucket. Not sure. Where are we supposed to go? Let's see, what's that active and pin? Buy a tin bucket. Yo, what's up? Oh. You heard Uncle Bill, you are the lucky one to get out of the farm. Don't forget the that bucket. Yeah. 
I wonder what the rest of our brothers and sisters are doing now, but they're so jealous we got to leave, but maybe a bit sad too. Yeah, we just gotta go this way then. We're off to the town. All right, well, this is kind of a slow start for sure. I was hoping maybe to fight something or something. Yeah, this is definitely the intro portion of it. Uh, Winston Willow down, farm east. Okay, so that's Valgate south. Then you go south, right? Yeah. To the south. Nice little statues, some more stuff. Uh-huh, uh-huh, cool, cool, cool. Oh, here it is. This must be like some form of teleport. Or something. Not sure. All right, this is it, right? Hey, you, old lady. Lucy! Well, hello. I was hoping I'd run into you. We've all heard a lot about old Bill's new ward. And everyone's more than a bit of curious about you. Me, I'm curious about everything. Especially the past. At the Vale's Residence Historian, I'm always on the lookout for relics and historic documents. So let me know if... Spot any. Not too bad, thanks. I heard third spring was the day Millie Ko was born. So this is how you find out about people. Dandelions are the small fluffy flowers you can find everywhere. When you pick one, you can tell the time simply by looking at where the biggest seed is pointing. Okay, so you have to have dandelions to tell time. All right, well, we just found out about so-and-so's birthday. What's 10 points? Friendly. All right, I'm not going to really read all the books. If you want to go through and read it, by all means, go ahead. It's almost nighttime though. We didn't even buy a bucket. Come on, we gotta buy a bucket before we run out of time. Yo, oh wait, this is someone, this is nobody. This is not even a town. This is just some old lady just chilling over here. Where's the town? There we go. Now we're in the village. That was, yeah, that was just some old lady chilling. Oh, we got an egg. Taking these. Give me these eggs. Thank you. I appreciate it. Ooh, I'm going to snag the carrots, too. Oh, I got permission. All right, look at all these people. Seven, six, what does that mean? I'm in need of cutting down some weeds to suit the size. Do you have anything for that? I've got just what you need. So, oh, I have to wait. They're are being occupied. Okay, cool. So you can't use the ledger. You need to, to be older. Well, well, so you're one of them whippersnappers old Bill took in. Done a lot of business with Willow Down Farm over the years. We have sickle spades, more spades, and various other irony things. If Jer Jeremy can forge it, I can flog it. I need sleep. <laughs> I heard the sixth spring was the day... 
Theresa Green was born. I'm finding out whoever all these people were born. So just reading. Dandelions are the small fluffy flowers that you can find everywhere when you pick one. You can, okay, I just did that. See that they're now buying stuff. Interesting. So this person has some stuff. Introduced. Hello, duck egg. I wouldn't hang around your our farm if I were you. I wouldn't hang around in our farm. Why? Our farm? My list has got a thing about trespassers. He's also got a thing about passers by, passers by, ramblers, hikers, visitors, and well wishers. Other than that, he's a lovely bloke, honest. Yeah, I'm a bit hungry. You want an apple? I got an apple. Ha! Nice. Secrets. We are not friends. Okay. Don't need nobody from that flippin' willy farm around our place, and don't you be bothering old Pappy. Man, so it's just like no one likes me. I'm hungry, but it's not your business. You're hungry too? You got an apple. She's unfriendly. Go away. This is not. Whoa, look at this dude. Man, he's is he running around naked. Oh my god. What are you doing, old man? Come here, I want to talk to you. Herbert Lemon, unfriendly. No, 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 no. You shall not go. No, no, indeed. Your uncle told me to watch you and watch you shall, Herbert. No, leaving the veil till uncle says so. Feeling better now, I suppose. Leave me alone. <laughs> Everyone's unfriendly. That has you feeling in the back of your skull. That is the stare of Druda. Digging into your soul. Make bountiful offerings or prepare to risk the darkness of the thousand curses. I feel great, no thanks to you. Go away. Everyone's, wow, there's a lot of people to talk into here. This is the tavern. Oh man, yeah, this is definitely gonna be a game where we have to be talking to people, building relationships and stuff like that. Definitely a lot of resemblance to Stardew, Stardew Valley. She's friendly. Hey, how wonderful to meet you. Is it truly, is it truly Drudia's generosity that has brought you to our village? For that we thank her. Not too bad, thanks. I got soaking wet picking mushrooms the other day, but they were worth it. Don't you must like mushrooms? Dandelions are the small fluffy flowers. Yeah, I already know that. Stop telling me about dandelions. All right, we need to buy a bucket. We got some berries, strawberries. Oh, here's some mushrooms. Oh, I can't pick those. Stand in line. We'll take one of those for. Ooh, what do you want? Oh, I can open it. Swear by the official's tent and often keep one on the bench. Huh. <laughs> 
So you just open the doors. Oh, who's this? I want this. Ooh. Property of the spice apple. Oh, it's a combination. Nope. <laughs> ah, nice. Well, what are you trying to show me here? God, this statue discover travel cost one apple. I have no idea what that is. Oh, here we go. There we go. This is where we need to be. Oh, check this out. That's cool. All right. We need to buy a bucket, tin bucket. Here we go. Tin bucket three. There we go. Sept. All right, we got Tim Bucket now. Greetings. Tiny prospective client, I am, I too am a non-native to these parts, but as anyone will tell you, I have florist here. And I'm certain you can too, particularly if you buy my products. You see, I saw a hole in the market which gave me the idea of filling holes for cash. Cash which I then used to build a stall, a stall which eventually became my magnificent emporium. Only in the veil is such a story impossible. I feel ill. Got anything to say? Not got not got anything to say to you right now. Price of it. What is this? Shop funds. Oh, we can sell some stuff. These things are worth some money. Oh, because he wants them. That's, yeah. How do, I, how do I sell? Boom, we're rich now. Is that a sausage? It's a puppy named Sausage. Oh, I can't afford this currently. It's a hundred. Oh, sausage. It says glass jar. We can make honey. We can get honey out of that. Let's buy that. Uh, we got that. What else we have here? Slingshot, Rose, Judah statue, Candy hair, Glass jar. We already bought one of those. Candy squirrel, a ball, a spade. Maybe we probably would need a spade. Flower, sleeper zest, night elf. Flower, ball. All right, we got a glass jar now, so we should be able to, what's this? Finders, not keepers. Edward Teapot lost bee hair tonic in burial grounds. Oh, these are tasks. Pig racing event takes place in, on days four and 11 of the month. Dresser Green wants item, apple. I have apple. Due to day takes place on seven days, or day seven and 14 of the month. Uh, let's see, goods market event takes place on days three and 10 of the month. Pig market event, pig market event takes place on, okay, big, big, big request. Town, Tom Co. was after the following, pear, apple, friendship, plus, 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 plus. Millie Cow wants item blueberry. I got that. 
cool. We got some stuff. We got some money. We're doing good. Uh, we can do some stuff. Let's see. I don't know who's who, though. Who are you? I don't know. All right. So item wanted. Somewhere over here. I'm trying to find this. I got blackberry or blueberries. I'm pretty sure. Just, do, 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 do. Who is who though? Is it? Oh, that's a that's a lead lead. Oh. I'm traveling Twada. I sell seeds and such. I just love sp speeding my sp <laughs> what speeding my seed. I'm in the village every second ninth day of the season, and that brooders cross every first and eight. Be sure to catch me for some seedy deals. Okay, well you're here now. Mhm. Mm what kind of seeds you have? Because I have money. Pork chop, chicken drumstick, ginger dye. So let's buy flour. Um, wait, wheat seed. I mean, we buy wheat or we bought flour. And now I want wheat seed. And we'll do. We'll just buy all the seeds. Yep, we'll do all that. Grasslands, a mystery, a mysterious item. A thousand. Ooh, I'm not that rich. Apple pie. Is that a recipe for apple pie? Yeah, it is. Flour, egg, and apple. You can make an apple pie if you can. Cool. What's this? You need to be older to buy this shop. So yeah, we can start buying things. All right, it's getting dark now, so let's head back. Oh, we got some apples. We don't have permission to pick those apples. Let's get back to town. Uncle Phil's gonna be worried. I need to go rest them real quick. All right, we're good. This is a quick one. Let's go. Let me get out of here. This. Oh. Pickaxe uncovers precious ore within rocks. Do not use on your nose. Huh. Oh, this this seems pretty interesting. I'm definitely liking this. Uh the there's a lot of NPCs here to get to know and befriend. We don't have a map of this place yet. Ah, let's, oh, here we go. Two more to find. Hmm. That's already nighttime. Uncle Bill's probably worried. So I like where he is. Whoa. Oh, that's the tavern. Probably wondering where I'm at. And I got lost. Grassy, uh, gassy apples are where they're at. That's That's where you make the money. Oh, I didn't mean to leave. Oh, this is the festival. How many hours to open for? Total cost. What was that? Oh, I can do like a little stand. Like a little... A booth like a sell stuff or something. First three seasons of the year, see strawberries grow below the trees. Oh, I'm so sleepy. I, I'm going to pass out here in the fairgrounds. Auction? Huh.
All right, let's. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna make it. Whoa, that's a statue. Uh, this area seems cool, but let's get out of here. That flower? Oh, didn't make it. <laughs> oh, day three. Zero brass waiting for you to collect. One new task added for the day. Yeah, because I didn't do anything. I didn't do nothing. Didn't get paid from my job. That's a wasted day. I'm, I just wasted a day. I made no money. <laughs> I need to start planting the seeds. You can buy seeds from the goods market on the festival green to the south of the village center. The market is on there every third and tenth day of the season. Here's three brass to get you some seeds. Hey, yo, guess what? I got that done. After you picked up the seeds, feel free to explore for a while. The market only comes around once a week, so it's a good opportunity to try and sell anything you have gathered. Also, take this one brass where it should be a game or two you can have a go on while you're down there. Just be sure to be home before it gets dark, as you will need to plant those seeds. So uh, what about, you know, nothing tastes quite as good as something you've thrown yourself in the soil. I mean, you don't want to be eating your own wart. The valley is full of decent folk, even the lady with all the cats. So you might want to hold your nose if you pay her a visit. The whole place is a litter box. <laughs> Ew. Um, it's raining. Want to hear about the dream I had? It's a bit fuzzy now, but I was walking through the woods and this voice kept talking to me. I think it said I was going to live forever. Isn't that silly? Yeah, you're silly. Feels good to be helping out Uncle Bill. I think the farm's been getting too much for him. For him. I hope I never get old like that. Well, that's rude. All right. I mean, I have seeds. Um, so we were going to go ahead and do some cabbage here. We'll put some cabbage there as well. Let's get these going. All right. And then it, since it's raining, this is perfect. We'll get these up right now. It'll be fully watered. No, don't stop raining. Don't stop raining. I'm trying. No, don't stop raining. Don't stop raining. Collect the water. Collect the water. Nice, so they're fully... Watered. Perfect. Perfect timing! Right when it was raining, we can collect... Uh... I got, um... Equipment? I got a container. If I go over here, if I can collect some, uh... Some honey. Uh, you got water now. Beat the pig. All right. So what kind of tasks do I have today? How do I know what day it is? Day, oh, day three, summer. So it's summer on day three. Markets are the lifeblood of every village. Here, people can buy fresh goods, bet on fun events, and try their hand at carnival games. The sights, the smells, especially the smells. Okay, so that's where we were just was. Where it was closed down. Um, item wanted. So we were doing that. Need to buy seeds from the markets. So we have to go there. Big request. Twig is somewhere around here chilling. I don't know where, but. Uh, uh, wait. Dream's Nook. Oh, yeah. Here it is. Dreamer's Nook. He's that way. He's that way. Okay, let's go to the market.
Buy some seeds. And I think that'll be it right there. Definitely relaxing. Chill, relaxing. Yeah, yeah. Not too bad. Northgate. Well, I guess we won't really experience the combat or anything like that in here. Um, there is like a turn base fighting system where we have to, you know, maneuver between like certain points and stuff, like to dodge and counter and stuff. So we'll probably. Um, get into that later, you know, if I, uh, do a playthrough series on this, you know, if you definitely want me to do a playthrough series on this, please let me know. Uh, you can always like the video or comment the video as well. Let me know, like, hey, you bet we want more. And I'll be like, oh, yay, I will. And then we'll play some more. Then we can get into it, and then we can see what's going on. All right, the market was down... Look at this guy. Here, I believe. I think we were just there. Yeah. Festival. No. Yeah. Is this what we're supposed to be doing? Okay, here we go. Pack of four. Oh, we got a pack of four. So I bought those for a pack of four. All right. Well, he just gave me more money. <laughs> Sucker. All right. So we can get a pack of four. What is that? Cabbage. We bought a pack? Cabbage. Why would I want your cabbage? Carrot seeds. The auction. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm thinking I'm going to go ahead and call it here for the video. This will be the end of the episode for the Let's Try It Out series. Like I said before, if you want me to go ahead and keep playing and do a playthrough on it and see how this is going to play out, uh, let me know and I will do so. You know, I, I am enjoying it so far and it's looking pretty interesting. We barely dived into it. We just scratched the surface on this. Like I haven't experienced a combat or anything or tried out really much. So other than just kind of run around and get the idea of the basic mechanics of what the game has, and see that it's going to take a lot of communication and, and relationship building and uh, we could buy shops, sell stuff, you know, all kinds of stuff. We could farm. So, yeah, a lot of good things to do. So, all right. Well, that's going to be that. Thanks for hanging out, and thanks for stopping by, everyone. I really do appreciate it. So, uh, if you want to see more videos like this and, um, and, you know, videos of a different type of builders, city builders, and any variety of games, just go ahead and subscribe to the channel, and you can see those videos. But even either way... It's still cool. So I'll talk to you all later. Have a good one. Peace out.